This weekend, ceremonies in our nation's capital are being held to honor law enforcement officers who died in the line of duty last year. 11 local fallen law enforcement officers were named and they were engraved on the National Law Enforcement Officers Memorial, including two Nassau County deputies. News for Jack's reporter Brianna Andrews spoke with the Nassau County Sheriff's Office about this very somber moment. Oh, say. From Northeast Florida to nationwide, law enforcement agencies gather in D.C. to pay tribute to those who gave the ultimate sacrifice. The honorees include Nassau County deputies Joshua Moyers and Jack Gwines. Moyers was shot and killed during a traffic stop. Wines died battling COVID-19. Well, it is very emotional uh, going through these events because uh, it's just like you're reliving the incident over again. And uh, uh, but it's something that uh, we need to do. We need to support their families and uh, make sure that they're never forgotten. Moyers and Gwine's names were engraved on a wall at the National Law Enforcement Officers Memorial. In total, 619 names were added. Each name was recognized during Friday's candlelight vigil. Last night's candlelight vigil was unbelievably powerful. They listed off over 600 names of men and women that have died this year in the line of duty. And um, it was just very special for the families. Emotional, but it was touching. As a form of tribute, Deputy Moyer's patrol SUV is also in D.C. It's painted to honor officers who died in the line of duty and will be used by the department's honor guard. It's a mark of respect that will live on forever. Brianna Andrews, Channel 4, The Local Station. Tomorrow, the President and the First Lady will honor law enforcement officers who lost their lives in the line of duty in 2021 at the National Peace Officers Memorial Service. It's expected to begin at noon.